Welcome to Matters With. I'm your host, Philip Bryan. Today we're here to discuss movie matters with you. Not only movie matters, but shoe matters and basketball matters. Air, according to legend, is directed by Ben Affleck and stars Matt Damon and is written by Alex Convery, his first film. This is also the first film produced by Affleck and Damon's Artist Equity production company. The story is set in 1984 and tells us how Nike's basketball division, their sales and marketing team, went from being the black sheep of Nike to making their basketball division their crown jewel by signing a rookie player named Michael Jordan to an exclusive contract and building their entire basketball brand around him. Today, that seems like a no-brainer decision, but back then, that move was bold, bold, bold. Matt Damon leads an all-star cast of tremendous talent. He is so convincing in this as Nike talent scout, Sonny, that you forget you're looking at the same face as Jason Bourne. Jesus Christ. That's Jason Bourne. The ensemble cast is excellent. Chris Tucker, Jason Bateman, Julius Tennon, Marlon Wayans, Chris Messina, and the world-class Viola Davis. From the opening credits and throughout the film, they capture 1984 with near perfection. The script is tight, and Affleck's direction here is the best it has ever been. His knowledge and love of the craft is on display here better than even in The Town or Argo. I think it was a wise choice of him not to cast himself in the lead, but rather as a supporting character, Nike CEO Phil Knight. That way he could truly focus on the filmmaking. Watching this, I struggled to find something to criticize. What I did see was so minor. For example, why is every car spotless? They did such a good job of capturing 1984. Every car, everything looks period. But why is every car no dents, no scratches, no dirt? In most movies that take place in decades past, you will see cars, modern cars that look really out of place in the background, somewhat blurred out or not even blurred out. There's none of that in this, but every car looks like it just rolled off the showroom floor. There's also one minor editing glitch with the cars where you see a car behind Damon on a highway and then you see that very same car later as he's turning into a neighborhood, which didn't really make sense. But again, that's very minor and happens in the background. Also, when Damon's in the 7-Eleven, everything, every product is period appropriate. Yet also fully stocked and perfectly faced like no one's ever actually shopped in the store. See, these are my criticisms. These minor things happening in the background. That, that's it. That's it. There is a scene with Matt Damon and Marlon Wayans where they use a static shot multiple times yet make it dynamic. Yes, a static shot that is dynamic. The camera isn't moving. The actors are not moving. Yet they take that still and make it dynamic and part of the storytelling in that moment. That is rare. The care in which Affleck presents this film is also uncommon. He met with Jordan multiple times to make sure that Jordan felt the people who believed in him before he was the brand he is today were honored. Every supporting character and actor gets a, a moment or multiple to move the story forward, add depth and shine. Viola Davis was personally chosen by Michael to play his mother, Dolores, and she is great. Great. Call out to Michael Mayer, who played Peter Moore, the man who invented the Air Jordan shoe. He doesn't get a lot of screen time and didn't get a character poster, but he is compelling and dynamic as the shoe engineer who created this. One of the most recognizable shoe designs in the world. I'm no mark for Jordan. Here's a picture of me in 1991. As you can see, I was rooting for the other guys. But credit goes where credit is due, and his story is something. And this story 
is something. The cast is beyond good. The script is charming and endearing and, and deeper than you'd expect. The direction is borderline brilliant. Air, according to legend, gets an A. Let me know what you thought of Air. Please comment below and also like and share. Just do it. We'll talk soon.